the duct tape girl over yonder across the road there that I sometimes refer to. I was over to her house just now. The playoffs are coming. Maybe somebody's coming over for a NASCAR party. And you see what I've done? You see what I'm doing here? I'm making these little bowls. I'm hollowing out these spams. That's a full spam right there. Each one of those, that will be the bowl. I'm going to cook four of these in this glass baking dish. Be careful when you're opening your spams. I don't recommend that you go out and buy this special, but if you somehow end up there at the house with some spam, and this is stuff, it's pretty good on its own. It's already cooked, you know. There ain't nothing wrong with spam. You, you, well, it's good enough for the government. It's good enough for me. And that's going to be... We, we going to cook with spam for a while. And you see what I'm... I'm going to save this right here and make some... Uh, about, I'm going to make about nine or ten chip spam sandwiches. You chop this up, put a raw onion in there, and about a half a jar of mayonnaise or more. But you see, this is real easy to do, and ever how many guests you're having over is how many of these that you would prepare. And uh, But I'm going to bake four of these, and you just place them in the baking dish, like so. Uh, if you're going to bake more, then you just have more baking dishes. You put them right in there like that right there. We're going to bake these in the oven. Well, you can see what we've what we've got here. You see that we've got the four spam bowls. And what I'm going to do is just ladle this this chili. You fill up you fill up each one of them. Now fill it full. Uh, you, actually, you want it on the verge of too much. Put your chili in that spam bolt right there. You see, Yonder? Just, just take your time. Uh, don't, don't be, don't be getting your chili all over everything. Oh, you see what I did? I'm gonna rake that back in there. No, it, you, it. Well, actually, we're gonna do that anyway. But uh, you want to be kind of have some order in your cooking. Uh, I'm not gonna say stick to the recipe or nothing like that, but you do need some order in your cooking. Uh, keep it over there on the individual like that, and put you some more in your put, fill it up to where it will stream over the side. This is well, and I may drizzle a little bit. Well, I'm gonna do it, and uh, no need to do it. I'm just gonna show you what I'm gonna do. Uh, uh, by all means, if you've got some chili left over, I would like to have another can, but I don't. So, you know, it's kind of make do with what you got. Okay, now we've used up all of our chili. So what I'm going to do is put these in the oven, and then, I'm, and then we'll come back and look at them. In, in the meantime, I'm going to chop this. No, I'm not going to chop it up. I'm going to keep it like it is. I mean, it's pretty good on its own. There will be some left for a sandwich tomorrow. This stuff very good. Spam, I recommend it highly. I, I don't know nothing about the food value, but it's pretty good. Spam, anytime the neighbor brings it in a can, try to bum you a couple of slices. We're going to get her out of there and dish it up. I'm going to show you what we got. Hey, y'all see that? Look yonder. Hey, we talk, we talking. We talking uptown, uh, we talking on the south side of Chicago. Uh, we talking uh, Back Street, New York. We talking down south. We talking, uh, we talking the Super Bowl. We talking NASCAR, Redneck. We talking New York City. Do y'all see that? I baked one extra 
because you never know when someone's coming over you they will have a tag along so I did bake an extra and you see these are not stuck they're hot don't be fooling around when your food's hot hey y'all look at that it's a it's a chili in a spam bowl and if I may I show you how I'm going to serve this it's what the neighbor had you know you just when you when you are borrowing you don't be too choosy it's well it's it's it, it is actually the cheese of choice I mean we talking uh, um, we talking this dish uh, we, worldwide. Uh, I was trying to, y'all see what we got there? And i tell you what, if you think we ain't uptown, I got these here sun-dried, sun-dried tomatoes. It was a leftover. Oh, this is going to be good. I don't know how many is in there. Let's just go ahead and well, you can't hardly go wrong on a sun-dried tomato. All I can say, just leave a comment. Prepare one one of these. Now, we here on the east coast of Arkansas, mind y'all, it's a chili spam pot pie. I mean, call it what you would. A chili bowl, a spam delight. Uh, call it what you like. Uh, I just, I'm putting this... Uh, uh, if it's state fire worthy, leave a comment. Chili in a spam bowl. And I did luck out. It was kind of pure luck that I came up on the neighbor lives down yonder on the other side of the crossroad. She had laid in these here. Uh, their store brand. Do you see this? This. Uh, when you're preparing a dish and you have about this many left, uh, you know, just go ahead and, you know, throw them on there. Plus, more. You know what you could be doing right now, as a matter of fact. I just was a studying on it that if you was not watching this most beautifulest, and the aroma is just unbelievable. If you were not watching this right here, you could actually be... You could actually be watching some dude, or even maybe even a good look, nailing up plywood. I mean, I did it myself, went up there and watched this girl. She was uh, some kind of home improvement, and the girl's nailing up this four by eight sheet of plywood. I actually watched the whole thing. And, well, I, and as a matter of fact, I watched some dude put up like the world's fastest plywood putter upper. I mean, that dude, he be a nailing some plywood I'm talking about it now. I mean, you do have that option, but I'm going to suggest that you would be at a loss had you not just witnessed. I mean, just look at it. We talking, we talking gourmet here. I may have got above my... No, I ain't. Uh, it's going to be spam for some time now because we're behind on our quota. And the duct tape girl has uh, seen fit to, when I seen her come, I seen her, I took her in the truck down yonder. I'm, I, when she comes out of that store with a cardboard box, you can bet that it's full. This time, it was spam for your enjoyment. Chili in a spam bowl.